Donald Trump has trolled the mainstream media and holy shit, have they lost it. So basically, guys, what happened was Donald Trump has retweeted this video. Play it now. Some of the libtards on the left are not happy with this. In fact, people are losing their shit. Now, I've got a few. I've got a few here, so we'll play that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one. Guys, this is just a sample of how the libtards on the left are actually carrying on, and it is insane. People have not realized it's just a meme. It is people shit posting. So this is what I've done. I've, I've pinned it to the top of my timeline on Twitter. Please go to my Twitter account and retweet this thing. Now at the time of making this video, it has had 205,000 retweets, 329,000 likes. This thing is blown up. Now, obviously no surprise, the hashtags that are attached to this retweet aren't in the trending list. Oh, big surprise. But of course, the 25th Amendment is. <laughs> Twitter, you're showing your bias again. Now, obviously, guys, it's not just the liberal libtards that are losing their shit over this tweet. In fact, mainstream media has been crying and whinging and going on about being called fake news since O'Keefe decided to nuke CNN. In fact, we got a clip here. We'll play that. I'm a CNN commentator. I think that is unacceptable. I think that is the president of the United States taking things way too far. It is an incitement to violence. He is going to get somebody killed in the media. Maybe that will stop him. Yes, that's actually the mainstream media now claiming that the president actually calling the mainstream media fake news will insult violence. But hang on, wasn't it your parent company that actually went through and sponsored Caesar in the Park? And isn't that the play that Dick Peaks, the, the president, being stabbed to death several times in a violent fashion? So if the president tweets about you being fake, that's going to cause violence. But when you actually put a play on stage assassinating a president lookalike, that's not going to incite violence because it's not like this happened. Now, a developing story from the U.S. A mass shooting near Washington, D.C. has left a Republican congressman and four other people injured. The congressman critically. The shooter who was killed in a gun battle with the police was known to be highly critical of President Trump and his allies. Oh, wait, that actually did happen. Sorry, my bad. But like, seriously, is anybody actually thinking that Donald Trump retweeting a meme online is actually, or him calling them fake news, is actually going to make someone take pot shots at the mainstream media? No, probably not. They're only doing this because it's backfiring on them. This is a term or a phrase that they wanted to go through and to use against alternative media. And then when it came out that they were actually the fake news, it's backfired. And they're getting upset when everybody calls them fake news. So let's just keep calling them fake news because it's funny. But at the end of the day, guys, let us know what your thoughts are in the comment section below. Do you like this man or, or did you retweet it? Let us know what your thoughts are in the comment section below. If this video has been helpful, please smack a like. If you know the channel, welcome and subscribe. And apart from that, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day and enjoy.